your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Sarah Plake with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for July 19th. Today, police are investigating how another person was killed in Kansas City. It happened around 1 o'clock this morning near 40th and Jackson. Investigators say at least one suspect tried to rob a man. The man was stabbed while he was sitting inside his own car and later died. Police are looking for witnesses and gathering more information. This marks the 104th homicide in Kansas City. And in Kansas City, Kansas, one man is dead after a shooting. Around 10 o'clock this morning, police say a suspect fired multiple shots at the victim and another person near 72nd and Lathrop. The suspect got in a car with another person and drove off. The victim was taken to a hospital and later died. And we're following each of these violent crimes as, as they happen to help you stay up to date with what's happening in your area. You can find the latest information on our homicide tracker. Find it on, on KSHB.com or download it on our free mobile app. All right, turning to coronavirus, starting today, you'll be required to wear a mask out in public in Clay County. The order is for indoor public spaces. The county has seen a 36% increase in COVID-19 cases in the past two weeks, and it's also seen a 300% increase in hospitalizations in the last month. Your forecast is next. I'm meteorologist Gerard Jabaley. Luckily, the heat is giving us a break, and we're going to see our next uh, chance for some rainfall as we move through later on this evening and tonight. Our uh, frontal boundary is kind of stalling out, and that's good. It'll keep the uh, chances of rain up, and with that, we'll see uh, th uh, thunderstorms and some showers really uh, developing through tonight in through Monday. So good rain chances moving through Monday and into Tuesday. This will keep our uh, temperatures down as well into the 80s. So uh, don't expect a whole lot of heat but plenty of uh, cloud cover and maybe a little bit of rainfall. Temperatures will uh, stay fairly mild as we head into next week.